Meanwhile, students in Riviera ISD won't be in class this week and may not even return until at least next Wednesday. That decision was made by district officials after an uptick in COVID cases. Our Michael Gibson has more of the details on that decision for us tonight in this report. Last week, the 491 students in the Rivetta ISD were only going to school for half of the day. District officials went to that schedule because some 25 COVID positive cases popped up. But then things didn't get much better as that number went to 41. So the district canceled classes for this week and maybe for even longer. Students were scheduled to be out of school next week, Monday and Tuesday. If I, um, together with the team, recognize that we need to take a second week off, then we will. And whenever students make it back to the classroom, all of those COVID protocols will be back in place along with mask wearing. When the students return, um, the plexiglass uh, will be up in the cafeterias. Um, the desk shields will be up in uh, the classrooms. We'll continue to do um, social distancing. Another part of the school experience was also shut down again. The Seahawk football team's game was canceled last week and now again this week in light of the COVID concerns. Unfortunately, uh, the football team will not play this Friday, but watch out um, the following Friday. Our boys are still um, conditioning at home. Um, they're, they're doing what they need to get done. The superintendent reminds all students that the missed time in the classroom will be made up during the school year. She also says teachers right now are still at work and looking to come up with highly focused lesson plans. That's to ensure students will get the help they need to keep them on track this year as COVID continues to impact life inside and outside school. Michael Gibson, 3 News.